In this movie, we're going to cover how to draw basic shapes inside of Adobe Muse. So the first thing I'm going to do is create a brand new site by going to File, New Site. And I'm just going to accept the defaults here. No need to change anything right off the bat. I just need a blank canvas to work from. And so once I do that, I'm going to double click on the home page so that we can start adding some shapes to our website. So now I'm going to come over here and grab the rectangle tool. And the rectangle tool is the main shape tool that you have inside of Adobe Muse. So what I'm going to do now is just draw out a shape. And if I want to draw a perfect square, of course, I can just draw out by holding down the shift key and that will draw out a perfect square. I can also just draw out regular rectangles by clicking and dragging out like this. And one of the things that people ask me all the time is, why can't I draw circles in Muse? Well, as a matter of fact, you can draw circles to a degree. Let me show you how to do that. First of all, start off with a rectangle, clicking and dragging out like this. And then once you have a rectangle drawn, what you need to do is come up here into the options bar and right up here, find the corner radius dialog box. And then just start clicking this up until you round the corners all the way around. And once you reach a certain radius, they won't be able to be rounded anymore. And so in this case, I pushed it up to about 115 and now I have a circle. So you can do circles, you just have to sort of trick Adobe Muse into letting you create them. So again, let's review here. To draw out a basic square, all you do is hold down the shift key, click and drag. To draw a rectangle, you just click and drag like so. You can round the corners of any one of these at any time just by adjusting their corner radius. And then if you want a true circle inside of Muse, you select any one of these squares that you created here and then just adjust the corner radius until all of the corners round off completely and you have nothing left but a circle. Other than that, there's not really any other shapes that we have available to us in Muse, and that's mainly because of the restrictions on the web. We can't display many different kinds of shapes on the web without using images because of the restrictions with HTML and CSS. These basic shapes you see here are easily accomplished with HTML and CSS, and that's why we're able to draw them. And we're only tricking Muse into using these as circles. These are technically just rectangles with a really, really large rounded corner radius put on them. So even though we can't do a lot of different shapes in Muse, there are still a lot of things we can do. And as you can see, you can really customize the shapes to make them look exactly like you want them to look.